Warning, this video contains spoilers for episodes 5 through 8 of season 1 of the Netflix original series, Stranger Things. So if you haven't seen these episodes, don't watch this video. Go back, watch the episodes, and then come back to this video. Thank you. Hey guys, Kanemuk up here, and today um, I'm back with another Stranger Things review. Today I'm going to be talking about episodes 5 through 8, and um, basically that's all of season 1. By this video, I have covered all of season 1, and I'm updated on the series. Okay, so let's get started. Um, the ending of last season revealed to us that Will was actually in the... Um, darkness or as what we know now as the down under so the down under is basically as um as mike puts it is a flipped version of our world a separate universe but where everything's dark and barren and there's creatures and things and it's called the upside down um or at least that's what they name it but that's that. Um, so, the end of the last season, last season, last uh, episode, which was episode four, we found out that. Then, um, basically, um, L and the crew, or the gang, the crew, whatever you want to call them, go out to um, sort of just uh, get more clues and everything. So. Uh, while they're doing that, we realize that um, Will's body that they found in the lake previously was actually a fake. Uh, we find this out by the Officer Dobbs, uh, or Sheriff Dobbs, going into the morgue and looking at the body, which turns out it was fake. Um, after that, uh, he goes... And he gets to the, um, ma uh, Will's mom. Tells her about this. Um, meanwhile, the friends are doing stuff. Um, and, um, they have a fight. Um, they separate. Well, one of them separates. And decides he's gonna go find the portal, which will lead him to the Down Under on his own. So he goes off and looks for that. They decide they're going to go and look for it as well. So they all go. Um, uh, the one that separated finds out where the uh, portal is and uh, alerts all the others about what's going on and how the uh, bad guys are, or bad men as they call them are coming for them. So they're alerted, they grab um, Eleven, or L, and they go out into hiding. Um, Sheriff Dobbs then pursues them, helps them out, and brings them to the school. Bringing them to the school because there is a lot of salt at the school. Uh, ice melting salt. Um, basically... The reason for this was L could not um, could not really find um, Will or the sister's friend because she wasn't as uh, just into it. I guess I don't know. I, I couldn't. I can't remember the word. But um, yeah. So they have the idea of uh, sort of recreating their own. Um, <clears throat> tank uh, by filling a kiddie pool with water and the ice salt. They then have her go in there, find Will and everything, but at that point uh, the sheriff and the mom go off to find Will while the bad men come in to the school find them. So as they're running out of the school L uses her abilities to literally explode the brains of the people chasing them, and so they're dead. 
but then the creature we saw from the first episode shows up. Sensing the blood, the first, uh, first, the creature from the first episode comes out of the wall, <laughs> out of the, um, down under. Down under? No. The upside down. <laughs> So it comes out of the upside down, goes to attack them, chases them into the room. Uh, after exploding those people's brains, Eleven or L is too tired to be able to do anything. So she's on the ground, almost passed out. They carry her into a classroom, trying to run. Um, the monster chases after them, killing the people who were chasing after them. They were shooting the monster, it just kills them all. Gets in the classroom with them. Uh, they real, um, the kids use their, um, arm launcher to launch rocks at it, doesn't do anything. Then, Elle gets up, uses her abilities to force the creature against the wall, and basically kills it, uh, leading to her disappearance as well. We then skip a month later to where all the friends are back together playing Dungeons and Dragons again. They're all happy. It's Christmas time. They're all having fun. Uh, goes back to Will's house. He goes to the bathroom uh, because he feels thick. He coughs up one of the worms that were in his system from the um, upside down into the sink. That moment, he looks up at the mirror. It's like, okay, it's probably over, right? Then, you see a flash of him standing there. It's, he's, everything's still in the p same position, but everything around him changes to be how the Down Under looks for that split second, and then it goes back to normal, giving him doubt that he's really escaped the Down Under. Down Under. Upside Down. I'm sorry. Um, I've been reading a book, and it has Down Under it. I'm sorry. <laughs> and... It ends with uh, Sheriff Dobbs bringing some food and putting it in a box in the woods, supposedly for Elle, even though technically, from what we know, she is gone. And we know it's for Elle because he puts a pack of Eggo waffles <laughs> in the box. You would understand why if you've seen the episodes leading up to that. <sighs> but yeah. Overall, I think the first season was amazing. It's all that's out right now is the first season. I watched the entire day of it just today, binge-watching the whole thing. It was amazing. I really liked it. Uh, the music was good. There were a couple intense moments, like the chase scene uh, where the kids are riding on their bikes trying to escape the bad men. Uh, that was a really intense scene. Um... Another intense scene is kind of when the uh, monster is coming after him down the hallway. That was pretty intense too. But yeah, overall I really like the series and uh, I hope they continue to do as good as they did with season 1 with season 2. Um, post in the comments what you thought about this series if you have watched it. If you haven't, what are you doing? Go watch it. It's a really good series um, and if you haven't already... Make sure to hit the like button down below if you haven't already. Make sure to also hit the subscribe button and the notification bell to get notifications on when new videos come to the channel. So thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys later. <laughs>